thought it was fairly well established that when the telcos were saying 10, 15 years ago that this is somehow a zero-sum game and that the more people look at content, somehow the poorer telcos become, the politicians had understood that this is a positive-sum game, that the more people look at content, A, the more money the content players obviously get through uh, really terrible advertising and all those other things that they use to to fund themselves, including, to some extent, subscriptions, although subscriptions to companies like Netflix are, of course, decreasing now. Uh, but also the telcos made a lot more money because we as users are very happy to pay much more money for a more stable, faster connection. Uh, and I should say it's really been very, very noticeable uh, in telcos' own statistics how much people have been willing to invest more money in faster connections through this awful pandemic that we've had for the last now almost three years. People are willing to pay more for fiber to the home or for much more reliable uh, connections. And the threatened um, spike in content use and therefore the, the increase that we expected to see in, in, in uh, uh, traffic over networks through the pandemic never happened to anything like the extent that we feared. 